Google+, Plus, also known as G+, Plus, is the latest addition to the world of social networks. If you have a Gmail address, you can create a Google Plus account immediately by visiting plus.google.com. You can use any email. Just follow the instructions step by step. You'll then receive a confirmation message and you're ready to go. Once you've done that, Google Plus will automatically suggest people you can add to your circles. Circles allow you to easily categorize the people you follow into different groups. You'll notice that you already have four circles. Friends, family, acquaintances and following. Create as many as you wish and then drag people into different groups based on how you know them. For example, business, news or whatever you'd want to categorize them as. Now you can send targeted information to any specific group. You can also share content with extended circles, friends of friends, or just make your post entirely public by clicking public. When you post something on Google+, it appears on your stream. Every post has a share button, which allows users to repost other people's messages. The bar on the upper right corner that displays your name, a red notification square, a share button, and an icon with your picture in it is known as the sandbar. It appears when you use any Google product, like Google Docs, Google Maps, and the search engine. The sandbar allows you to post to Google Plus without being in it. All you have to do is click on the share button. Another feature is the plus one button. When you read something that interests you, simply click on the plus one button. Not only does it expound on your appreciation of the post, it also adds weight to Google search results by displaying your plus ones to the relevant search results of your contacts queries. In a way, you're helping your contacts find really cool and relevant content. Google Plus pages create profiles for different entities, such as brands, businesses, or news organizations. Al Jazeera English has a Plus page to interact with its audience by sharing news and engaging in discussions. This allows them to publish public updates that can be voted for and shared on other social networks. When someone adds Al Jazeera English to their circle, they have the ability to read and view all the news stories as soon as they're posted, whether it's an image, a video, or just an article. Another unique feature in Google Plus is the Hangout. It allows you to add up to 10 people to a live video conference for free. It also allows you to call US and Canadian telephone numbers and add them to the Hangout. It's very useful if you have regular group meetings. You can log on from any location. You can also watch a YouTube video or a live stream, like Al Jazeera English, and then discuss it by using the push to talk button or on the chat window on the left hand side. This option can also be activated from the YouTube website. The Hangout can also be used to discuss issues that you have an interest in with the public. Simply make your Hangout open for public and whoever has you in their circle can join the conference. Take Google Plus with you on the go with the mobile application. When you install the application on your phone, you'll be able to upload photos and videos directly to your Google Plus profile and also receive updates from your network as well as access the other Google Plus features. Hangouts are also accessible from any device that has a front-facing camera. Simply click Join to join a video call. The What's Hot tab lists the most popular posts from different people depending on how many comments it's got, how much they've been shared, and how many plus ones they've received. Additionally, the real-time search box on Google Plus is similar to the one on their search engine. When you type a term, not only will you get suggestions as you type, but you get live updates the moment they're posted. This search box also supports hashtags. Just push the hash sign before any word and it'll turn into a link. This makes posts with common topics easier to find and curate. Privacy on Google Plus is easy to manage. You can control aspects of your privacy and choose what you'd like to display or hide. You have the option of allowing people to access your photos, videos and posts. However, your profile name and identity will remain visible to the world. Despite the fact that Google Plus is one of the newest social networks, it's already managed to make its way high up the ladder, making it one of the most popular with business industries and news organizations. Its ease of use, as well as privacy features, including the ability to download your profile data, make it quite appealing to most users. Now, all you have to do is sign up, get a Google Plus account, and don't forget to add Al Jazeera to one of your circles.